When Georgian forces attacked South Ossetia and aimed directly at this cathedral, many of its congregation thought they will never again attend services within these ancient walls. The shelling was so intense, Father Yakov, along with many local residents, including women and children, hid in the basement of a burning building, thinking the end was close. We were hiding in the basement of a building with women and children and everyone had a clear feeling that we were on the verge of death. But it became even worse when the Georgians entered the city in tanks and armored vehicles and we could hear them speaking their language. Then we decided only God would save us and we prayed. The war seemed over. They were in the city. I knew that the cleansing process was about to begin. I guess women did not have a clear idea of it, but for us men it was obvious. You know, it's easy to do. They open the cellar, throw a grenade, throw more and more until no one was left moving. This is not the only cathedral attacked in the region, even though Georgians and Ossetians share the same religion. Our communities in the eastern side of South Ossetia are in a very grave condition. Georgians had control over those territories and the situation there could be disastrous. We don't even fully know how they are now.